Thank you for your purchase from SewingPatterns.com and Print Sew. I am the helper. I'm going to walk you through your first pattern and download. Basically, what we're going to do is we're going to go over here to your email. We received the email. We're going to go down to the printing pattern information. We're going to click on it. And it says, congratulations on your first pattern. This code right here is important, right here. We're going to go ahead and highlight that. We'll need to use this later. So basically, what you're going to do is just, like I have right here, highlight the code, right-click it, and copy. Now, we're going to click on the link right here, which is going to export us out of our email to the print so helper. We're going to go ahead and click on login. Would you like us to remember the password? If you're going to be using us a lot, you might want to remember it now. New upgrades, there are some plugins you need to download. A lot of the time people get to the screen, and they go to the file, open pattern, because we're just clicking away. We're happy we got our new file. We're going to click OK to install. We're going to go save file. Firefox gives you this nice pop-up window. This is the Firefox one. We're going to click on it right here to open. Double-click it. We're going to double-click Run. We're going to click Next. We're going to click Repair because I've had this previously installed. We're going to click Yes. And right here, a lot of people get this error. I'm going to help you get around this error. Just go ahead and click Finish. It's not a big deal. And what we're going to do is we're going to go back a page. So you're just going to back click one page. The main thing is to be able to use this stuff, you need to, this is what I do. I will go ahead and go to Please Don't Ask Me Again. And it takes you to the next screen. Once you're on this screen, you're going to need Adobe Acro Reader installed first. So right here, we go ahead and click on the Acro Reader. You go ahead and put download. I would recommend not downloading McCaffrey security software. A lot of people get a lot of different security programs downloaded on their computer that conflict. So we're going to go ahead and install the reader. We're going to right click on it. We're going to run it. We're going to click yes. And it's going to start downloading. It will take a few minutes, but once it downloads, then we're going to go be able to go back and download the file open. So let's go ahead and give this a few seconds to download. I'm using a computer pretty quickly. And I'll take this time to once again thank you for purchasing your sewing pattern. We're here to help you out. We are going to make some videos to walk you through this. We're going to get through this together. So right now why this is downloading, remember right up here I already have file opener ready to go as well. So we're going to wait a second and let the Adobe Reader download. We recommend using Adobe Reader. You can use any PDF reading software, but you have to have a PDF Reader download on your computer. So this is the easiest way to do it. We're going to walk you right through it. We also recommend using the Foxfire browsing software for your downloads. Uh, Google Chrome, like you saw on the first screen, has a bit of an issue. We, are, we have another video for Internet Explorer, so if you're using Internet Explorer, you might want to check out that video in our playlist on our YouTube channel. So as this downloads, we're almost there, and I will be here to walk you through it step by step. So installation complete, we're going to click Finish. It takes us to the window where you see that spinning. That means it's downloaded properly. We're going to close this window. We're going to go back down to our browser bar. We're going to go to our Downloads. Now we're going to go back to the file opener installer. We're going to click Run. We're going to click Next. Like I said, I previously had this installed on my computer, so I'm just going to click the repair. We're going to click Yes. We're going to click OK. And Finish. File open wizard is ended prematurely. Finish. Fine. Yes. Clear list now. Back to a lot of people have had the same problem I'm having right now trying to get the software downloaded. That's why their video is. 
Okay, so we're going to come over to here. Go to Documents. Go to Downloads. File Open. Click Run directly from my desktop. Click Next. And click Remove. So I'm going to remove File Open completely. Yes. So what I'm going to do is completely remove it from my computer. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to go back into my files. I'm going to go to the file opener again. I'm going to click run. I'm going to accept. I'm going to click install. Now let's see if it opens and runs. I'm going to click yes. And now it's installed. So now we can fix that problem. We're going to click finish. Now we're going to go back to our web explorer. We're going to go back to SoPrint, www.printso.com. We're going to click OK. We're going to go into my patterns. We're going to click right here. Now I have installed the plugins. So now that the plugins are installed, here's our pattern that we have. We're going to go ahead and select sizes. And remember that password that you have selected before. Oh, hold on one second. We got to select our paper size. So let's just go basic letter because that's what most of people are going to be using at home. And it says right here again, should not be using in Google. So we accept right here the licensing agreement from Adobe Reader X. Email address. This is our email address to contact us at printsohelper.com. And that password we downloaded earlier, we're going to right click and we're going to paste it. And we're going to hit submit. .com. And we're going to hit submit. And there you go. It helps if I remember the email. So basically, there you are. There's your pattern. It's in a PDF file. Follow the directions right here. And what we'll do is we'll just go ahead and zoom out of this for a second so we can see the overall. Go to start clicking on a couple pages just to show you. See, there's the pattern. It's all complete. It's all there. So now what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to print. 